Here at Women's Tech we offer um, training in non-traditional skills um, and I think it's very much about uh, building, building confidence, um, building uh, self-esteem um, but also building qualifications and, and employability um, and using the trades to do that has proven very, very successful for the women and girls who come into, um, into our centre. For me it was just, I didn't want to be into all the basic stuff if that made sense, so I was like what about joinery? And it didn't click with me. Engineering, no. But then whenever I saw mechanic in, it was like, it's very hands-on. So I was like, why not do that and give it a good try? There's no harm in first like trying about it. So I went in, enjoyed it and stuck with it. Yeah, a lot of girls are traditionally pushed for more retail jobs and things like that. They're not really pushed towards joinery jobs, mechanicing, engineering and all that. And Women's tech are tar like targeting women at a young age, primary schools, so they can get an idea of what they're capable of. They don't have to have just one idea of what they can do. There's all this other, there's so many more options for them, and I think what they do is great here. Women's tech's been amazing on my behalf because they were the ones that actually helped me get my first placement. So there was, and then from then they've always helped me progress. If I ever needed an or placement or anything like that, they've always opened their arms and came and helped me like so they've been really supportive by Devon's probably won't be around now like it's critical for construction at the moment as well know construction's very light on apprenticeships and people coming through into the construction industry particularly with women um, very very few I know a few uh, electricians and decorators and of course with Shannon now with us um, and they just bring so much to the table it's been an eye opener Children are talented in a whole range of ways, and that whole, I can do this, this is not just for, but I can do that as well. And these children leave here, the girls leave here, have that, that sense of worth and sense of empowerment that you don't, you can't measure that, you can't measure that. And that's long lasting, and that will live with them long. After they finish this project and the drills are put away, there'll be an attitude that will be changed about I can do this. I would say to young girls to try your hand at everything, to try and keep your opportunities open. Come and see us, um, even just talk to us, talk to your teachers in schools and don't let, don't let people put you off.